ready for you to come back. Are you ready? Uh, you know what? We're, we're making progress. Um, not quite there yet. We have a, a couple steps left to to accomplish, but um, you know, so far so good. I mean, I, f I feel pretty good out there. Um, you know, starting to get my timing back and uh, feeling more comfortable with contact and. Um, no, we're, we're going in the right direction for sure. Did you skate right into coach's office and say, I'm ready to go Wednesday <laughs> after today? Or well, you, you um, battling to get in there? Or? For me right now, I, I'm still in a little bit of a process. Um, not quite out of the woods just yet. Um, a little bit more rehab to do. Um, you know, probably another doctor's checkup and, and whatnot. But um, we're getting there. And, uh, you know, getting there is nice. And, um, being around the guys has, has been great the last three, four weeks. And, um, progress. It's, it's tough not to hurry, right? I mean, there's only eight, nine games left. It's <clears throat> right, they're right on the verge. On yeah. the, it's got to be tough not to rush yourself, right? Yeah, and you know what? I, I, I've kind of been battling that all year. It's not something that I want to rush or um, you know put myself or the team in a bad position. If I'm not, uh, if I'm not feeling like I can help, um, you know, there's no point of me being in the lineup. So um, we've we've taken our time up to this point, and I want to make sure that I'm 100% when I go back and uh, able to help the team um, any way I can down the stretch here. We're we're in a race, and um, it's been exciting to watch, but uh, be a lot more fun being a part of it. When you're not physically able to to go. Do you feel like mentally you kind of you focus a little more on the mental aspects of the game and learning about the game? Yeah, I mean, I, I've become a student of the game. Um, I always thought I was, but uh, especially in the last five months, um, I've really had to uh, kind of take a step back and, um, you know, learn the game from different perspectives and hear different input and, um, you know, if a team's doing this, then we can adjust doing this. And um, it's been kind of, uh, kind of an eye opener for myself. And um, I've, I've enjoyed it. Obviously, want to play, but um, probably helped me down the down the road. <clears throat> How nice is it to be in another playoff race two years in a row for you? Yeah, it's uh, you know what the the playoffs are the best time of the year, and um, if you get in, anything can happen. So uh, last year was a lot of fun. Um, third round was obviously not quite as far as we wanted to go. So for the guys that are back, you know, uh, we remain very hungry in our room and um, we want to make sure that we're, we're going farther. And, um, but you know, you don't want to look too far ahead. Um, we're still in the race and uh, lots of teams around us. So big games coming up, especially here uh, tomorrow night. They could use you these days. You need to get a few more, a few more pucks in the net right now. Yeah, um, I thought I thought we've been doing a really good job lately of getting pucks to the net, <laughs> and uh, um, you know we, we have the group here to, to put pucks in the net. Um, you know sometimes they just don't go in. Uh, I think if you've you know watched the last ten games, we've had a lot of really good looks on our power play too. Um, and sometimes it's, you're just going to go cold. It's just the nature of a 76 game season, and um, but you, you continue to get the looks. It, it will happen. And, uh, you know, that's kind of what we're preaching uh, as a group. A lot of guys coming back from injuries, obviously, Boutry being one of them. How, how nice is it for all of you guys to maybe get together right at the right time here before the end of the season? Yeah, well, that, that's what we're hoping. Um, you know, we're, we're kind of starting to get a little bit more healthy. And um, like you said, Moutry, you know, he's a big part of our team and kind of a jokester. But, um, you know, there, there's lots of guys that um, have been in and out of the lineup a little bit here in the last couple months. And uh, to get everybody back together, and um, especially at this time, um, you know, will be a boost met, uh, physically, but also mentally for us. And um, hopefully help our push here in the last nine games. What do you think the key has been? I mean, there was a coaching change early on, injuries, uh, but you guys managed to string together uh, quite a few wins. Yeah, I mean, I think for us, we've, we've had the team all year long. Um, it's just kind of putting it together and um, injuries, you know, different movements, up, up down. Um, it was just kind of a crazy part of the year, and that's what you get in this league. It's, um, you, you know, it's very unpredictable. And um, for us, we did, I thought we did a great job of sticking together, sticking through it. And, um, yeah, you might win, win five in a row. Yeah, you might lose five in a row. But, you know, as long as you're staying even keel, um, you know, talent comes to the top at the, at the end of the day. It seems like the locker room has also been pretty, uh, pretty loose even after a bad weekend. So how, how are you guys able to stay focused and still have a little bit of fun here? We know the key to 
key to success is having fun. Um, you know, uh, I don't know if it's our youth or, or what it is, but for us, um, having fun is key. Um, we, we don't want to go out there and play and tight, play tight, you know, gripping the stick. Um, we go out there, we have fun, we play hard, we play with passion, and um, that's what we preach, and that's what gives us our best chance to win every night.